The ramifications are huge when the president-elect of the world's largest archipelago and biggest Islamic nation comes calling to pay you a visit and renew the bonds of friendship and bilateral ties. And the president was more than glad to oblige earlier today as he received president-elect Prabowo Subianto of Indonesia as our Kenneth Pasciente reports. Stronger relationship between Indonesia and the Philippines. That's what President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr. and Indonesian President-elect Prabowo Subianto concurred in during the latter's courtesy call at Malacanang. According to the President, Subianto's visit to the Philippines is a huge deal as it only shows the stronger cooperation between the two countries. I think it bodes well for our two countries that you have come to visit with the Philippines uh, and uh, that shows that the growing relationship between our two countries which has been at a very strong level for many, many years at many, many uh, aspects of our, on the people to people, on the uh, political, on the uh, diplomatic. The chief executive is confident that under Subianto's leadership, the relationship between the Philippines and Indonesia will grow even more. We are about to celebrate our 75th year of uh, relations this November. And I think uh, your visit here uh, today will certainly bring a new impetus to uh, making that uh, relationship between Indonesia and the Philippines uh, stronger and deeper. The Indonesian president-elect thanked the president for welcoming him, assuring the Philippines can expect Indonesia's support in strengthening various aspects for a multilateral development of both countries. Perhaps it's uh, the Asian way, our custom before we enter into a new position we we call on our friends <laughs> and uh, to reconfirm uh, my commitment to strengthen the close relationship that we have traditionally between the Philippines and Indonesia we have common roots, cultural, uh, historical, and uh, by the fact that we are very close neighbors, it behooves us, I think, to always uh, support each other and to work together closely in all fields. Subianto is set to succeed former Indonesian President Joko Widodo as the president of the Indonesia in October after winning the elections and gaining 59% of the total votes. Kenneth Pasciente from the National TV Network for a new and better Philippines.